After accepting a new trip, your customer will receive an SMS text with the Track My Taxi link. The Track My Taxi feature provides your passenger with real time information on your location and your estimated time of arrival. Please avoid unnecessary delays getting to the pickup location. The active job screen will immediately show you any important booking information to complete this trip. The information may relate to your passenger, the pickup location, or how to record payment information at the end of the trip, so please take a moment to read any trip information carefully. You can access the booking information at any stage throughout your trip by tapping on the info icon located top left of the screen. The active job screen will list all booking details in a summarized view. You will see the customer's name, the pickup time, the pickup location, and the payment type. In this example, the payment type is on account. To call your customer, tap the green options button and then tap call passenger. To navigate to the pickup location, tap the navigation button located on the main screen, just under the pickup address. If you need to know show this trip after you have arrived to the pickup location, do not call the dispatcher, instead, tap the green options button, and then tap the no show button. You may be required to wait a number of minutes before the no show request will be approved. Please wait a few moments for your dispatch manager to process your request. When you get to the pickup location, use the arrived button. This will trigger an automated phone call or SMS text to your passenger to notify them that you are waiting at the pickup location. Again, if you need to call your passenger, tap the green options button and then tap call passenger. When you pick up your passenger, use the POB button. When the meter is started, you will see the total fare amount displayed on the digital meter. If you need to add extras, tap the extras section and add extras as needed. Waiting time will automatically add to the total meter fare. If this is a flat rate fare, the meter will start with the flat rate amount. You will also see trip labeled as fixed and will be shown to the right of the digital meter. When the meter is started, the destination location will be displayed. If you need to change the destination, tap the pencil icon and select a destination zone. If you need to take a short break when this trip is completed, tap options and then tap the short break button and when the trip completes, your status will be automatically set as busy. If you need to activate the panic alarm, it is located top center of the screen. Please do not try to test the panic alarm and only activate it in a genuine emergency. When you are approaching your destination, your status may be automatically updated as soon to clear and you may be offered a follow on trip. Tap the accept button to accept the follow on job. To complete your booking, use the stop meter button and then use the finish button. If this is an account trip, you may be asked to fill out additional information. If this is a regular trip or street hail, and the passenger wants to pay by credit card, please follow the card payment process as advised by your driver manager. When the trip completes, you will be returned to the home screen.